know what this reminds me of? Jeepers Creepers. What happened? Hello? Dude, I'm so freaking nervous. So we just got into the abandoned farm. As I told you guys, we are gonna camp out here. We've actually already set up our camp. This is where we're gonna be sleeping the night. I don't know what that noise is. We've been here like 20 minutes just setting up our tent and sleeping bags, and we haven't heard this noise until now. Ethel, is that you? Ooh, ooh. was that you? Who's I, moving? I didn't touch you. Really? No, no, no. Like something just walked by me. Like I felt the floor move. Oh. I can feel it again. Yo. Oh. Did it just feel like something's walking on the roof all of a sudden? All right, let's just, let's get a grip here. This place is mega haunted. You guys already know this. This is the exact abandoned farm that I got pushed off of the second floor. Yo! Mo, you okay? What the? Yo, what happened? And I've neglected. Yo. What is that? You can hear his voice. I hear a voice. You know what this reminds me of? Jeepers Creepers. Hello? Nah, bro. This ain't the wind. There's no way. They sound like birds. Alright, this is the exact farm that I've been neglecting to come back to because of how haunted it is and what happened to me the last time that we came here. I'm still feeling the effects of being here. This was like, what, about a month ago since we came here? Mm -hmm. And. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Oh my God. What'd you see, bro? Please tell me you saw that or you got any clip of that on camera. I don't know, man. I Holy shit, I just seen a woman standing right there. What? That's where our fucking tent is. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> bro. Bro, I swear to god. So we, we set up camp, right? And I was just about to go and start talking and, and filming for you guys. We set up our tent right there. Look at that. There's our, our tent right there. That door is open. I just seen a woman standing here. No way. No yeah. A hundred percent. We haven't even like checked out the farm to see if there's anybody here, any homeless people, any animals. We literally came up the stairs, threw in our tent. That's gotta be wind. Yeah, but I heard voices. I heard a sound. I heard voices like too. Words. I did. I did. We threw in our tent. That door was closed. We haven't even been inside that area yet. That freaked me out. I seen a woman, dude. Like actually, you know what she was wearing? Here all night. You know what she was wearing? What? Black, just all black. Oh my god. That window's freaky. Is this a window or a mirror? I don't know. Oh, great. We actually have a freaking mirror here, bro. I hate mirrors at nighttime. That's like my, my I'm, I'm afraid of mirrors at nighttime. Like actually. Woo! All right. So I've been neglecting to come back here because this place is so freaking terrifying. And ever since my last video on the island. Um, I got really, really sick the moment I got there. And the stories about that island is if you go there, the spirits don't like you, they make you sick. And I got so ill that I've been out for like, I haven't posted a video on this channel in like eight, nine days, maybe 10 days. And I'm really sorry about that, you guys. But I've been ill ever since that island. I finally got my energy back. And the first thing I'm doing is coming here to a freaking haunted farm that almost killed me last time. Now, if you guys don't remember this video, follow me right now. Hey Ethel, and if you haven't watched the first video we did here, there's a ghost, a very, very bad, bad spirit named Ethel. She haunts this place, and she made it very, very clear that she doesn't want me here the last time we were here. And I got pushed right over here. Look at that. This is exactly where I got pushed from. 
Bro, that's a high fall, bro. Yeah, like it's high, but not that high. But because I wasn't expecting it, it hurt. Like I fell, you know, I couldn't grab on anything in time. And everything, look, everything's so flimsy, you know? Oh, what the f Yo. Yo. Someone's been here. What? Someone's been here. These yeah. were not here last time. No. Is it fresh? Well, I don't know, like, it looks like someone tried to light up candles. Bro, people are stupid lighting candles in a place full of hay. Like, you're gonna set this shit on fire. Look, there's even hay on it right here. I mean, they're not fresh. They've definitely been here for a while. Oh, behind you? What'd you see? Fuck, bro. Something's moving. Something's moving in there. Hello, Ethel? Ethel, can you make it clear that you're here with us right now? Is that you that's that's making all these noises? Dude, I hear footsteps here. Yeah, there's something walking around. I haven't even started the spirit talker yet. Let's go and look around. There's another two barns that we actually haven't showed them. Let's go and check those guys, those guys out because we actually haven't even been inside of them ourselves yet. Let's check out those other barns and then walk through this place. Make sure there's nobody. Ooh, oh, what the hell that was, was that? Bird, eh? What was that? Yeah, it's a bird. Oh my God. Dear God. Dude, that freaked what the shit that? out of me. Like why now? Why now? I, I honestly believe that spirits can take like shapes of birds, honestly. Let's get out of this area. This area freaks me out hardcore. Let's go. Hey, Ethel, please don't hurt us. Okay? Is there another floor up here? Look, bro. That's why I'm looking up. Yeah, there's something up there. What is it, like a, an attic type of yeah. thing? Unfinished. Look at this hardwood. It's actually pretty nice. Yeah, this room's pretty... You heard that. Yeah, I heard that, man. It's definitely not the birds. Something big just moved in here. Like really, really big. Hello? Ethel? Okay, those birds are annoying. You got a you got a BB gun? No, I'm just joking. <laughs> let's let's get out of this area. All right, we're gonna assume every noise that we're hearing right now is the birds, but the heavy noises definitely not the birds. You hear that again? Yeah. That was that was like some knocking. This area here honestly freaks me out. There's something about this area in particular. Every time we come here. What the hell is that? Can you do that again? Is that you, Ethel? Ethel, if you're with us, make a noise. Make something happen. Bro. Okay. You know what? There's only one explanation. Let's let's go outside and see what that is. Let's go. Right? Yeah. Oh my god. Right? You like the noise? Yeah. I hear There's I, a voice. I hear a man's voice. Me too. too. Yeah. I really do. Bro, it's coming from in here. I doubt we'll last though. Already, I've seen Ethel, bro. I doubt we're gonna last. Yo, sounds pissed. Dude, I heard the voice. He's saying hello, hello, hello. I heard a hello too. I wonder, if too? The, I wonder if the microphone picked up on it. I hope so. So we're actually outside right now. 
Look at that's the no, like, right? No. It's not coming from inside, it's not coming from outside. Where the hell's the noise coming from? That makes no sense. So this is one of the barns that we haven't seen yet. There's not much of it. Yeah, there's not much going on here. It's all destroyed. This place is completely like destroyed. Except except the area where we're camping out in. Yo, so this is another area that we haven't been into yet. It's like another barn. Bro, imagine there's like a dead body up here. No, don't say that, man. Yeah, there's, there's nothing here. Yeah. Nah, definitely nothing here. Might as well show it to the sergeants. All right, so as you guys know, Halloween is literally around the corner. We're pretty much in August right now. Um, I'm very excited that I'm gonna be launching a new set of merch during Halloween. I've already launched some new stuff. Yo, Tom, my boy stuff, Tom's Haunted House merch, bunch of ghosts and stuff on new merch. So if you guys haven't purchased that merch, please get it, the links are down below. These videos almost always get demonetized by YouTube because they're so scary. Um, so if you guys wanna support me, I really would appreciate it. Please support me by getting yourself some merch. I would really love it if you supported me supported this channel to keep making more videos. It's getting harder for me to make videos. Like honestly guys, if it wasn't for Mo right now, I would have no help um, in my city. Like literally everyone's gone, disappeared. No one wants to make YouTube videos anymore. That is from my city. So it's getting very hard for me to make content. That being said, I am planning a new Ontario road trip soon. And I think an Arizona and Vegas and Area 51 trip. So if you're from these areas and you wanna collab, you must have more than 500,000 subscribers if you wanna collab. Um, let me know, hit me up in the DMs. We can make something happen. But for the time being, I'm gonna give you guys creepy farms. I do have a lot of them that I'm gonna be visiting in the near future. Some new haunted forests that I've discovered that I'm gonna be visiting as well and a lot of cool things that's coming for this channel. I know I've slacked off a little bit, but I promise you guys, videos are gonna start coming really, really soon. I've just been dealing with my health after that island, a lot of stuff behind the scenes also that I, you know, wasn't enabling me to, to film. I do have two kids now, as you guys know, and it's getting harder and harder for me to film, but I am gonna stay on that grind. So yeah, let's go back to the grind now. Bro, places like this would always have like underground tunnels, like secret bunkers and stuff. Like abandoned, like abandoned forest. What is in there? Ugh. Ew. That's disgusting. Some sludge. <laughs> That's nasty. What the f was that scream? Bro, that came from the farm. I heard that. That was a female screaming. That was a legit female screaming. This is the part where I turn on the spirit talker. I'm gonna turn on the spirit talker. Ethel, is that you? Ethel, talk to me. I'd like to know why you pushed me off of the second floor last time I was here. Do you remember me? Drink. Drink what? Oh, she's not afraid of that. The jar? Is that what you want me to drink out of that jar? What's in the jar? What kind of liquid is that? Is that PP? Has anyone from Brampton been here recently? <laughs> <laughs> Ethel. All right, now I'm making jokes. Ethel's gonna be pissed, dude. You open the jar. Open it? Yeah. Nah, bro. Imagine there's a body part. Bro. 100% that's contaminated. It's disgusting, don't inhale it. Oh. Wait, I mean, at least it's sealed. It looks like motor oil. Like it's kind of got that same consistency. Yeah, that's definitely motor oil. It's okay. gotta be. Okay. Why do you want me to drink? What am I drinking? Yeah, what'd she say? Bro, she said we're delighted you're here. Who is we? All right, let's go inside. Bottom floor. Spirit talker running in full force and see if we get anything. What I'd like to know, Ethel, is who is we? Who's with you? Cheers. Sounds like explosions. Right? I don't get it. Why are we hearing? Did you hear a voice? Did you hear that voice? 
What the fuck? Girl voice again. On? Yeah. What is going on here? Bro, are we gonna walk in there? I don't know what's going on here today. Like, there's some weird shit happening right now. Um, I don't know why the spirit talker is not giving me anything at this point. Ethel, Yo, stop bro, right there. There's a light right there. Look, there's a light. There's a light right here. Huh? Bro, what's wrong? Bro, I just seen a light inside, man. Inside the building? Inside the building. What do you mean? There was a big light inside the building. This, this door just literally just closed. You said you saw a light in there or someone? No, I saw a light. That that definitely wasn't the wind. Let's just be clear on that. No. There's no wind right now. You did say you seen something in there. Yeah, I saw a light. There's probably someone inside, bro. There's nobody here. There's no way. Bro, the door just fucking slammed shut. Are you serious? Yo, someone was here. What is, what is that? Someone's picture. I don't want to show it on camera though. Oh my god. Yo, the door literally just slammed shut in front of our faces. Yo, what the fuck? That's fucked up. Like this door. That's lodged in there, dude. That's so weird. Right? Yeah. Bro, there's someone here for sure. How's that gonna close? Something pushed it. Ethel. It's gotta be Ethel. Let me see if the spirit talker is saying anything. Um Oh my god, I mean dude, my, my audio was off. Great. I'm a little sad. I understand you. My name is Helen. We're listening. Oh, maybe that's what she meant by we. Yeah. So there's <coughs> oh wow. <clears throat> That was weird, it's like something just choked me. So there's two female spirits in here and they're both assholes. You hear that? You're both a bunch of hairy assholes. That's so weird. What is that? This was not here last time, dude. Good morning. Blue buckets are Trixie and Vigo. The stacks of three is donkeys and Betsy the cow. Green is goats. Pigs. I guess it's like a, a note. This was not here last time. That is so weird. Is there another one? Is that like a riddle? What is that? It's like a, a nickel acknowledgement of risk and release liability. Whoa. That's crazy. Hey, Ethel. Ethel? Go back there. Go back where? Where the note was? Okay, I'm going back. I heard what, what sounded like hay being dragged over there. I, like, yeah, when I said look behind you, like, I thought someone don't was freak there, out. Just, just aim the camera because the mic will pick up on the noise. Okay. Ethel, we're gonna sleep here tonight. I got my tent upstairs. Everything's cool. We're just gonna camp out. Do you give us permission to camp out here tonight? Moving forward, I gotta explain something to you guys. That glitch that you guys just saw on the screen is because the entire next clip that you guys are about to see was completely corrupted by something paranormal. And for me to recover this clip, it cost me a lot of money and it also came back to me partially corrupted, which is why there's gonna be some glitching. Ethel! I guess that was permission from Ethel. I heard the foot, they're walking. Someone's here. I know, I just heard something scream. Ethel? Bro, I'm so scared. I can make it cold. 
bro, the last time we were standing in this exact same spot, she said, I want to make it chilly. Oh my God. And now I can make it cold. Do you actually feel the cold? I feel it right now. Do you feel that? <laughs> right in the spot. Right now. I hate this place. I fucking hate this place. Why the f am I here? Bro, I'm not sleeping here tonight. Fuck that shit. Yo. I didn't notice this part last time. I noticed this one. But not this I don't remember part. this room. What's behind this? Oh, it's just like a door. That's cool. Hello. There's nothing in here. Ethel, how do you make it cold in here? Is that just like us feeling your presence? Oh my God. What is it? Bro, we didn't look in here last time. There's kids toys everywhere. What? Look at that. There's literally children's toys everywhere. What is this? There's spiders. There's a ladder up there too. Dude, look at that. There's a, oh! What is it? Dude, zoom in on that doll's face. Which one? Look at that doll's face where my flashlight is. Oh. Zoom in on that. That is freaking creepy. What the hell? Why in here though? Ethel, why are these toys here? Can you talk to me? You know we're standing on like manure, right? It's disgusting. Ada. What'd she say? Ada. Hey Ethel, can you tell us who Ada is? Killer. Killer. What? Was Ada a killer? Coming here today, I hit up Mo. I'm like, hey man, you wanna, do, you wanna go do a camping video? He's like, yeah, sure, let's do it. So I didn't tell him where we were gonna camp until we got here. Um, but I also don't have a plan. Like, I don't know why I'm even here. I just wanted to come and camp out here tonight. It's been a, like, I felt like it's been a minute since I've done a camping video. And well, it's been like nine or 10 days since I got sick. And I'm due for one. And by the way, that island, I'm going back there with a jet ski and I'm gonna sleep there the night. Just the last time I got really sick. That's where I fell from. I got pushed. Let's rephrase that. <laughs> I got pushed, I didn't fall. Exactly. I'm not dumb, I'm not gonna fall. I got pushed. Right, you stupid ass hoe? Or are you just pissing her off? Well. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> what are you sorry for? Imagine she says for pushing you. Oh my God. <laughs> it's like the perfect butt scratcher. <laughs> right here. Well, when well, there's a butt scratcher. <laughs> you know some horse was like rubbing its ass on that all day long. Oh, for sure. <laughs> so if you guys missed episode one, I highly suggest to go back and watch it to find out like more information. But one of the key pieces of information is that this place was built on top of native land a long time ago. We are in the Algonquin area of Canada and there was a, a, a big tribe, the Algonquin tribe, years and years and years ago. And when the colonizers showed up, they killed a lot of them. And a lot of them were mass buried in places like this. So it, it, that's why I believe this place is haunted. And coming here the last time, we got a lot of answers. Yeah, Mo and I just heard what sounded like a grumpy man off camera. It's coming from that side too. It was, right? Hello, grumpy man. Is there a grumpy man here? Imagine. Go hide somewhere. Go hide somewhere. Go hide somewhere. There's someone here. There's someone here. Go hide in the next one. I'm in a closet right now. Yeah, that was not spiritual. That was definitely somebody here. We heard a grumpy man. What is that noise? Yeah. Hear it. Hear that? It's coming from upstairs. I don't even want to leave this closet right now. All right, we're going back up to our campsite. Hey, notice that we haven't heard that banging noise in this area? So far all night, we haven't heard the noise. Let's see what happens now that we're here. All right, spirit. Ethel, you've been really silent now. We haven't heard your slutty voice all night long. 
Ethel. Hey, can you? What the f was that? Did that just come from in there? Yeah, bro. Wanna go check it out? What the hell was that? That was loud. That was really loud. What was that? Oh my god. <gasps> what is it? Something doesn't want us here. That came from the roof, dude. Look at that. Bro, that landed right on the tent. Can you explain? What the f oh. I'm saying? Can you explain? Unexplained. What do you mean unexplained? Why'd you do that? Bro, the, the nails put a hole in my tent. Oh. Oh. Why'd you do that, Ethel? It doesn't want us sleeping here. That's why I did that. That's the only reason why I did that, because it doesn't want us sleeping here. So this tent's fun, but it's not gonna be fun in the rain anymore because it's got holes in it now. Oh, shit. Oh, that shit. Yeah. A couple of holes here. A couple of holes there for the nails. Man, my tent is ruined. I love this tent. I heard something. I wanna go sit inside. All right, let's see if we can get anything. Hey, uh, Ethel, I think it's gonna piss her off. I think it's gonna piss her off a lot that we're just gonna sit here and chill. I'm not here to antagonize her. All that called her a slut a couple times, but you guys know that's how I be. All right, spirits wanna mess with me, I'm gonna mess with them. Mistake. Bro, what the f Making a mistake. What do you mean by mistake? Like, you're just giving us one word. Can you give us like a whole sentence if possible? You said drink before, mistake. Give us a whole sentence. Why is this a mistake? Or is it a mistake that I called you a slut? You're pretty slutty, not gonna lie. I don't know what I'm expecting, but I don't think it's gonna be good if she does show up and like comes in here in full force with like her girlfriends. <laughs> her girlfriends. Notice how all the names we've been getting is like Helen, Ada, it's all females. Yeah. Why though? Are you guys like, like a fe feminist movement or something? Like a spiritual feminist movement? Is that what's going on here? You see two men chilling, camping, trying to have fun, and then you just want to like rain in on our parade because you just don't like us? Well, let me tell you something, lady or ladies. Without men, you would have. Almost. I almost finished my sentence. I was gonna say, without men, you would have nothing. Boy, you're pissing them off. I don't know, I feel like she's standing right outside of the tent. Are you standing outside of the tent? I feel like you're here. If only you guys could be here to feel what I'm feeling right now. You don't feel it, Mo? I do, bro. I'm sweating. It's it's like she's standing right here. With my flashlight. Hey, Ethel. Are you here? Oh, 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 oh. What happened? Grab my hand! Bro, what the f? Oh. He grabbed my hand! It just pulled me out of the fing tent! What the fuck? Did it you take your flashlight? He grabbed my fing hand! Oh, oh, did you? Get in here, quick, quick, quick! I need a light. It just grabbed my f***ing hand. What is it? Oh. My. God. What does it say? If you think that was bullshit, me getting grabbed, f*** you. Look what it said. I'm reaching out. Bro. Oh my it God. just reached out and grabbed my f***ing hand and pulled me out the tent. 
Bro, I'm not sleeping here, man. Why? Why are you doing this? Okay, now I'm gonna take this seriously because I was fucking around before, joking around, talking shit to her. Ooh, I feel very lightheaded. Why are you doing this? I'm so scared. I'm so fucking scared. Yeah, well, let's get out of here. No, nah, bro, we're not leaving. We're sleeping here tonight. This guy wants to get out of here. We're bro, I thought we're, we're gonna sleeping. camp somewhere nice. This is nice. Fuck, this man. is the best accommodation I could, I could afford. It's free. YouTube <laughs> 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 keeps demonetizing all my videos. Buy merch. Help me help me go travel places and go to like further places. Um, okay, this is not the time or the place. You know what's weird? When it pulled my hand, it felt I can't I can't explain it. So it didn't feel like a man's hand. Like you know when a man grabs it, like you can tell because like a man's thumb. Thump. What the fuck does that even mean? Okay, so like when you get grabbed by someone, like you could always kind of tell if it's like a female or a male. This felt like a female, but when it grabbed me, it felt it felt so weird. It felt like hairy arms, like actual hairy arms. Like imagine being grabbed by like Bigfoot himself and pulled and Bigfoot's hands are hairy. That's what it felt. Why are your hands so hairy? Oh man, I can't believe this shit. I wonder if there's anything up top. Should I climb this thing? Oh. I'm gonna climb it. I'm gonna you keep can climb this, it from there. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this rolling. You stand here because this is not really safe. For the record, I have no reason to climb this shit, but I feel like there's something up there. Oh, you okay?